Now the video overlay or the PIP tool. So we'll go over to where it says PIP, this right here. I'm gonna select that here and we can use this tool to either insert a photo or another video. And I'm gonna be very weird in this part here and insert this very weird video that I recorded just for the sake of this beginner's guide. You can long press any of these here to preview it, to get an idea of what's going on here. I'm gonna insert this here, and when you insert that video overlay, it's gonna appear like this here for the first time. And you'll see the length of it, versus the original here. You can shrink the size of it, place it to another part of the video that you want it to be. And maybe I want this video to appear in an animated way, just like the text and the stickers. So what I'm gonna do now is select the animation here and you'll see these right here. Same thing, you got the in and the out. Maybe I want this to appear from the right, go, I mean from the left to the right, and then perhaps go back to the left. So it's going to be this here, like that, and you can increase the speed of how that goes or how slow it goes, like that there, and then the outro, how my video is gonna exit. Now, maybe perhaps I wanted to maybe swirl out. Let's go swirling out, okay? And this one here, the red one, is the speed of how fast or slow the animation plays. Okay, so we'll go ahead now and press play just so you can see how this is gonna appear in the video. So it's gonna appear like that, and then you'll see it's going to exit out swirling out like that, okay? So that is that, my friends.